Your Eminence, Philippa, Honorable Council General, fellow clergy and presbyteras, ladies and gentlemen, Christos Anesti, Christos Anviat. Let's get a little Romanian in there. On behalf of the clergy of the metropolis, I take this opportunity to congratulate all the recipients of the 2013 Laity Award. The clergy applaud your dedication and devotion to the church and thank you for your service of love. We especially recognize the young adults chosen by our parishes who are entering leadership positions in the church. As Father Ted said, this year the clergy, along with his eminence, have been devoting much time to young adult ministry. Our metropolis, shepherded by his eminence, are reaching out to empower and equip, equip young adults to reach their God-designed potential. We know that the road to adult maturity is paved with series of challenges to be met and conquered. St. Paul in his epistle to the Hebrews writes, let us lay aside every weight and sin which clings so closely, and let us run with endurance the race that is set before us looking to Jesus, the founder and perfecter of our faith. The journey of those in their 20s and early 30s is one of transition, an exploration in vocation, identity, a purpose, relationships, and spirituality. The landscape to adulthood is different and the journey a bit longer than previous generations. Today, with a tendency to delay marriage and parenthood, a more meandering path to a stable career, and difficulty in attaining financial and emotional independence. Surveys tell us that Jesus among young adults is virtually unknown, recognizable only as historic religious figures memorialized in religious relics and icons, with a very minimal knowledge of the most basic elements of our Orthodox Christian faith. Surveys are scary. But what can we do about this? Scripture teaches us that what is most needed, what is most needed, is spirit, mature spiritual adults willing to develop personal relationships that invest Christ's grace, truth, and love into the young adult's life to help empower and equip them to reach their God-designed potential. St. Paul writes, let us consider how to stir up one another to love and good works, not neglecting to meet together, as is the habit of some, but always encouraging one another. You and I are called to be people committed in investing in the spiritual vitality of our young adults, empowering them to discover their identity and their purpose in the midst of God's larger story. We are called upon to help navigate the ever-changing social landscape where values and markers are no longer clear with a willingness to listen, learn, and walk the path to Orthodox Christian maturity together. Shaping the next generation through spiritual mentoring is by far the most powerful strategy Christ has given us for shaping the church and changing the world. We need to challenge and support our young adults as they walk the way, the truth, and the life offered by God the Father, discovered in Jesus Christ and imparted through this Holy Spirit. Together, laity and clergy, we can equip young adults to continue the ministry of Christ today and for the generations to come. This is our task. We ask you to help us to take a young adult, be a spiritual mentor, walk with them, talk with them, guide them in their Christian journey so that the church that we have today will be a church that is much more stronger tomorrow. Who's so sinister?